For multi-field quick lists, let's consider a real-world scenario. Let's say that I'm doing a report for the Copper Creek neighborhood, and Copper Creek is a tract home subdivision, all built by the same company, usually using the same subcontractors, plans, and materials. I know that 95% of the time, these seven fields will be the same for every property in the Copper Creek neighborhood. Rather than save and then use each of these seven fields independently, I'll create a multi-field quick list to save them as a single entity. To create a multi-field quick list, you fill out the fields the way you want them saved. Highlight the fields you want saved by click and dragging from the top to the bottom and then clicking new in the quick list pane. The new quick list is then added as the next quick list in sequence for the topmost field used, in this case the foundation walls field. If I clear these fields and go back to the top field, I can see the multi-field quick list there and can use it just like any other quick list. The next step is to obviously ask, well, if I can do that with those seven fields, what's keeping me from scrolling up and highlighting the entire neighborhood section, then creating a single quick list entry for it? Well, nothing. In fact, you can select any set of fields and save them into a multi-field quick list, even if they're not contiguous fields. For instance, the first place I'm likely to run into the Copper Creek neighborhood information is going to be the neighborhood name at the top of the form. To select multiple fields all over the form, hold down the control key and click on them one by one to select them. Then, save the quick list like normal. Remember, a multi-field quick list entry will appear in the topmost field after it's been created. In this case, the neighborhood name. Using quick lists in this way, you can easily create a neighborhood database for yourself using any combination of fields you want.